I think overall it was a really positive experience. I think uh, what I enjoyed most about computer science is that it really bridges theory and practice. Um, so some of the classes that I took were a lot more theory based. Um, for example, like my algorithms course and my data structures course, they were extremely like um, concentrated on like abstract problem solving. But then I also had classes that used those algorithms um, for more practical purposes like data analysis um, on real data sets and um, coming up with conclusions, um, conducting my own experiments. Um, so I really like that computer science is the perfect more than a lot of other majors is a connect between the practical industry applications and the theoretical like basis of it. Because of the cross disciplinary attitude between departments, I think uh, that within computer science you see different disciplines. And the interaction across the disciplines, whether it be theory or systems applications or simply uh, embedded research like, like this one, I believe that there's many ways to contribute to this larger, uh, larger branch of computer science. And I think Duke Computer Science has done a very excellent job of trying to fuse all of these uh, components together. So when I try to find someone to do independent study with, they're all willing to offer this opportunity. I know this is absolutely not normal for some other schools. Right? So it's really hard to approach some professors in some, some schools. Right? But in Duke, like, they're really approachable. They're willing to help us. They're willing to advise us. And actually, we, I, I spent a whole year with Professor Munagala. We, we, we did work together. He advised me, provide valuable insights and valuation and evaluations of this project. As you progress along the computer science curriculum, I do get the sense that the department is focusing a lot more on how they can show students computer science in the real world. So whether that be through like fast connections project, where you can do research and you can see like, okay, this is where my code goes and like this is what it's doing. Um, through things like Data Plus, through a new initiative called Code Plus, I think. Uh, where basically students just come and like learn how to code and like write good code and write real code over the summer. And even through the support of other student engagement activities like Hack2, where you can create real applications that like do real things. Um, I think that the support of the computer science department for teaching students how computer science works, not only in a classroom, but in the wider world, I think is really special. And I think they're definitely moving in the right direction with how they're expanding that. So they give you the tools and the building blocks to you know, be a good computer scientist and a good mathematician, but then they, make, they help you and they make it for you to figure out what you want to do with that. They make it really easy, so there's a ton of research uh, ex uh, opportunities with individual professors or things like Bass Connections uh, where you can do more int very interdisciplinary things. The computer science department does a really good job of making you realize that like, computer science is a superpower you have and that you can then use that in a variety of different disciplines, right? Every class is designed to inch you closer to a more complete skill set where you can be an asset on any project, any team, regardless of what it's being applied to. And we found that here with the gerrymandering project, uh, that like the skills that I learned in 101, 201, and all the following courses, all of those came into my ability to be able to work on this project. And I think uh, because the uh, department is so excited about project work and about like building your education to make you accessible and make you able to do these kinds of projects, um, I think that's why we were able to do this work in the first place. So.